In today's video, we're taking a look at how to install a battery temperature sensor, easy and simple. It's so simple, anyone could do everything that we use on the video, we're gonna leave a link on the description. Don't forget to like the video and subscribe, that does help us out a lot, thank you. So this particular battery temperature sensor for solar charge controller is made by Renogy. But no matter which battery sensor you have, the technique will be the same. And what adding a temperature sensor to your system does, it optimizes battery performance and extends its lifespan. And it does that by censoring the varying temperature, changes that occur throughout the year. So it basically senses the ambient temperature around the battery to accurately provide temperature compensation. This ensures that your battery is receiving an accurate and proper charge according to the ambient temperature where your battery is located at. And this particular wire is a 22 gauge wire with a two pin conductor. It measures 9.8 feet and it has a temperature probe at the end. In your case, instead of having a clip on connector it may have two strip wires and this model has a wide temperature compensation range up to 176 Fahrenheit or 80 Celsius and it is ROHS compliant and rated for outdoors and this is a straightforward installation you basically want to verify on your charge controller where it says temperature sensor and you're either gonna have a clip-on style connector or a screw-on wire terminal which if you have a clip-on connector you would just align it and insert it on the connector. If you have a stripped wire end, then you want to loosen the screws, insert the wire, and then retighten the screws. And this would be the same technique as adding any of the previous installed wires on your charge controller. In some cases, you might have the screws on the back. Once installed, you want to place your sensor pro closest to the battery. We like placing it right on the top of the battery because it has the less chances of moving or falling. You can also place it on the side walls of the battery. And remember, you are the king, queen, both or none of your castle. Wherever you place it is okay. And now you've done it. Your charge controller will be able to sensor the ambient temperature around your battery and start adjusting to the changes throughout the year. Don't forget, if you like this video, please give us a thumbs up. That really helps. If you have any questions, place them in the comment section below. Either someone on the Statabox team or someone on the YouTube community can help you out with an answer. Don't forget to subscribe, follow us on social media. Thank you for watching and here's a link to our latest video.